This is Terminator Salvation Parody, number 800. Today, Kevin Hellions plays John Connor. The machines outnumber us now. I don't know why. It might be because I'm using the machine to talk to you. It might be because we still have computers. And we still have machines that we use for things. And even our weapons have sighting. God's sakes, we have planes, jets, things like that. And we wonder why the machines outnumber us. I also need to ask you what timeline this takes place in. Because I complain that I don't know why my mom didn't leave me a cassette explaining that the machines can look like humans. Even though when I looked like a young Edward Furlong, I rode on the back of a motorcycle with a machine who looked like a human. By the way, I would put something up that says spoiler alert on this. But you can go to fucking Walmart and buy your Marcus as a Terminator. Get up. Dress up. Costume. Whatever you like to call it for children. Now the first two movies were rated R. This one's PG-13. Still not fucking eight-year-olds. Not that I'm still not fucking eight-year-olds. The movies are still not for eight-year-olds. Why is a costume at Walmart? Why does it ruin a plot point for the movie? Speaking of not for eight-year-olds, pick up the new Max magazine with Moonblood good on the cover. She's the girl in the Terminator Salvation movie that you'll say, who's that? Now you know. It's Moonblood good. And knowing is half the battle. But the battle goes on. And it goes on with us fighting a naked Arnold Schwarzenegger. Thankfully we didn't get raped. This is John Connor signing off. Thanks for taking time to watch the video. Thanks for watching out for the machines. Now continue to watch these videos on a machine.